Hey everyone. So this is our week eight of our planting series, of our spring planting series. And um, we are gonna go through zones five through seven because they're, the list is getting smaller as to what the restrictions are for different plants. So a lot of things have already gone out. A lot of things are, are outside, they're not covered or they're under a single layer of protection. I'm not gonna go over the same list. So if you have missed anything or you have questions about a certain plant, a spring plant, then I would suggest if it's not in this video to uh, refer to previous video because I'm not going to cover, I don't want to cover the same thing that I covered last week. So for this week, um, April 19th is our week eight. We're going to start with zone six, which is a frost date of April 25th. Um, and like I said, I am always shooting a little bit later because as you can see, it is still cold outside and we are still getting some frost. So my rule of thumb for my zone, which is zone five, is Mother's Day. And the zones differ by about two weeks. So the difference between zone five and zone six is about two weeks. The difference between zone six and zone seven, about two weeks. Frost dates are always estimated, so you really have to be um, paying attention to your weather and to your climate. So let's get started. Zone six with the frost date of April 25th, outside under no cover, you can either remove the cover or you can plant these things outside. You can do bok choy, oregano, potatoes, radicchio and salsify all right now outside under a single cover or a single layer of protection you can sew these things outdoors or you can remove the second layer of protection if you have these things under a double layer you can remove one layer and they can go under a single layer now so those that list is going to be artichoke basil beans celery cilantro corn, cucumber, melons, pumpkin, sage, squash, that's both summer and winter, and thyme. Now those things need to go under a single layer of protection. Um, and like I said, during the day, you might have some nice weather, the temperatures might get up, go ahead and uncover them. But when those temperatures start to dip below 50 degrees, you definitely need to be covering those plants, okay? So zone five with a frost date of May 9th, which is Mother's Day, under a single layer of protection, you can sow these things outside or you can transplant them. Or if you have them under a double layer, you can remove one layer. Basil, beans, corn, cucumber, melons, pumpkin, winter squash, and sweet potato, okay? Now, under no cover, you can remove the cover or sew them out without cover. Artichoke, celery, cilantro, sage, summer squash, and thyme, okay? Like I said, make sure that you're watching your weather and any temperatures below 50 degrees, you want to make sure that you offer those plants protection. Zone seven with the frost date of April 11th. Under a single layer of protection, you still need to have basil, pumpkin, and sweet potato. Those things still need a little bit of protection until about two weeks after your last frost date. No cover at all. You can put out your artichoke, beans, celery, corn, cucumber, melons, winter and summer squash okay like i said make sure that you watch your weather any temperatures below 50 degrees whether it be day or night you want to make sure that you are covering your plants and offering them protection if the temperatures rise go ahead and uncover them give them some fresh air and if you're transplanting 
anything out to the garden, please make sure that you are hardening off your plants. Don't take them from an indoor situation to an outdoor situation without acclimating them first. Okay, I did do a video on that and I will link it at the end of this video. Um, so that's going to be it. That's our list for week eight. And um, I'm thinking this might be the last week. I'm not sure. Um, I might go ahead and go all the way through Mother's Day just because that's my um, zone. <clears throat> or I might just go through until everything has been out and under no cover and we're done with all the protection measures. So um, I'll have to figure that out. But this is week eight and it's April 19th. And that's your spring planting list for the week. I hope you enjoyed the series. I hope you are um, following along. I hope you guys are making sure that your plants have cover and hardening off and all that good stuff. And um, I hope you guys are preparing for this cold snap we're getting. I don't know if everyone's getting it, but I know we are. The next couple of days, it's going to get down to about 32 degrees at night. So I'm definitely going to be offering some protection to a few of my plants and um, making sure that um, everything is everything. So anyhow, that's going to do it for this video. Until next time, the more you know, the more you grow. Bye guys. <laughs>